Hello, Gemini, and welcome to your weekly general message. Thank you very much for being here. Please uh, give me a thumbs up if you don't mind. And if the reading resonates or you just enjoy it, please subscribe and share. So let's get you some cards for Gemini. What does Gemini need to know for this week? Oh boy. Some cards for Gemini, please. Okay. Let's see. What did we get? Wow. So <laughs> check us out. Knight of Swords. Wow. Charging on. Now, the Knight of Swords, I always like to look because the court cards tend to be uh, people for me. Uh, this would be more or less, a, not more or less, a, a fire sign, which would be Aries, Leo, or Sagittarius. So um, the Knight charges bravely into battle. It's Sir Lancelot, Defender of Chivalry. I, I am checking my, my little book since the, the court cards are certain cards that always throw me a little. Um, he's a skilled warrior who rushes into situations without weighing consequences. His charm, charming nature gets him out of scrapes. Well, I have to say, when I hear charming nature, uh, every Gemini I've ever met is very capable of talking themselves through or out of situations. Uh, but sometimes they go in too fast and too hard and sometimes regret what they're saying. Um... And you have the Queen of Wands. The Queen of Wands is the, uh, wands are about passion. Oh, I'm so sorry. <gasps> I wonder why I did that. Swords is air signs like us, Gemini, Aquarius, and Libra. I apologize. Wow. Brain fart. Maybe I made that mistake on purpose though, because now we have the Queen of Wands and this is our fire sign. This would be someone who tends to be a little older. You know, she is not your 20-something. Uh, uh, she has experience in life. So um, this is the one who talks about uh, sunshine lady, brings light and love to people around her, hostess, tireless worker for charity. So maybe what you're doing is you are speaking out in an effort for, uh, for a cause. Wow. It's really interesting. So you're speaking out for a cause, you're charging in, but there's the Four of Pentacles. So to me, this talks about uh, getting started, starting to move forward. And then the Four of Pentacles, you're just kind of stopped. There's stuck energy. So you're not actually going to be moving forward. This is awful. I, I'm peeking at this because this is, this is talking about holding on to material things too tightly. So this says, you know, you want to speak your mind and bravely go in and maybe stick up for somebody. And, you know, the, the queen of wands, she's, she's very nice and very sweet, but stuck. Like Gemini, you're stuck. Like you can't, you're having a hard time moving away from something to get your new start. That's what this says to me. I think there's an opportunity for a, a wonderful new start, but you're, you're stuck whether you're concerned with moving. And that's what comes to mind, moving from where you've lived for a while, or maybe you're not, uh, you're not feeling comfortable about a career change because of the, the four of pentacles, I would say it has something to do with uh, your physical life, you know, where you live, where you work. Uh, those are the things that you're holding on to and protecting your heart. Because in this one, he doesn't have them under his feet and everything. He solely has it on his heart. So this is to me all about your heart. You know, opportunities exist, but you're not moving forward. So, okay, Gemini, let's get you a Keepers of the Light Oracle card and see, maybe this will give us some more clarity and hopefully a, uh, a positive end to our week. Okay. Keepers of the Light, card for Gemini. Okay. What did we get? Mother Mary, love and peace. Oh my God. You know, it's a good thing I do this on camera. Let go of the need to be right. Choose peace Mother healing is possible at this time. So maybe what this is talking about is that 
not us not being open to someone else's ideas. And because we're not open, we're unable to move forward. So, see, I knew the Keepers of Light always give the best advice, I have to say. Really the best advice. So let go of the need to be right. Choose peace. Mother healing is possible at this time. So have you been maybe arguing with somebody? Not agreeing? And this is talking about letting go and just being. I love it. Awesome. Thank you so much for being here, Gemini. Good luck. Have a great week. Bye-bye.